go back to Hydra. Actually, you know what? I think I'll go back to Hydra. I kind of want to... I want to finish this task. I've been, like, holding it off. Well, not really holding it off. I've just not been doing it for quite a while. So, yeah, let's head back to Hydra. I can use these in the dungeon now, which is cool. Myself an elite from Hydra, but more importantly, we've got ourselves 740 runecrafting XP. Look at that. But yeah, let's go do this elite. I also have an elite and a hard in Watson that I couldn't be bothered to do before, so I might go grab myself an easy and a medium, go get myself a master and do that as well. I went and collected myself, as you can see, I still need an easy and a medium. I collect myself these clues, so let's collect ourselves a master. What is the first step? Show this to Sherlock. I forgot some teleports. Let's go do this master and hope we can actually do it. Just two I was looking for. Let's... No, no, that's not the one I wanted. I think that only takes me 88. So yeah, I need to get myself one smithing level, but... One smithing level. And now let's go see what how much we are going to get. I've got to remember to actually change it over to coal instead of just collect. So yeah, let's collect and see how much coal we are going to get. 6,000, not too bad. 26 sapphires as well, 2 rubies, 2 emeralds, not too bad. 100 ranars, pretty nice. Any good seeds? 2 ranar seeds, dude. Hell yeah, that's that's really nice. 84 smithing poggers, but kill 100, so... That's perfect. Oh, the double mystic staff drop, hell yeah. The voiceover I did for this clip was stupidly long and drawn out, so I'm just going to summarize it up real quick. I want to get the Master Wand for in case I ever do get the Kodai. Here's the amount of points I need on the screen. I'm going to try and smash out the uh, enchantment tonight and do the rest of it tomorrow because I'm not doing it tonight. It's midnight. Slight change of plans. Doing all of the enchantment was taking quite a while, so I decided instead I was just going to go get myself the Apprentice Wand which I now have enough telekinetic points for and I'm going to do Alchemist now and I've done Graveyard but I forgot to record it. It's... Yeah, we're just we're, alchemist time now. Don't worry about it. Never mind. 23 points. This is going to take me up to 31 total points, which is pretty nice because that means I have enough points to go buy myself the apprentice wand. So, yeah, uh, beginner wand value. Yep. 30, 30, 330. As you can see, I have enough. So, let's buy the beginner wand. Nice. We got ourselves a little, a cute little stick. What kind of stats are we looking at on this? I don't think I've ever actually got plus 5 magic. Alright, as long as I have done my maths correctly, this should get me up to 60 points, and it does. Nice. Let's go and buy ourselves the Apprentice one, because I didn't record getting the other two, because I don't want to just flood it with clips, but hey. Yeah, let's go get the Apprentice one, and then I might just start straight away with... Uh, the teacher wand as well. Apprentice wand, uh, 60, 60, 600. Nice, let's buy it. Cool, it's now, we've now got a little bamboo stick. Yeah, pretty cool. Hang on, what's the stats on this? Ooh, it's twice as good. Nice. So yeah, that is 3,900 enchantment points. This really doesn't take very long. No, don't DC, don't DC, don't DC, don't DC. Please. Dude. I've got 53 points, please don't DC. Please, why? Okay, so this is not a massive milestone, but this is going to be 9 million magic XP, which is just, it's just pretty, yeah, it's just pretty cool to see. All right, progress point. Let's show you how I am. I've been doing graveyard. Well, I've been doing telekinetic until I run out of run energy, and then I went to go, go do graveyard. I've nearly completed graveyard, only 12, 13 points to go. Uh, and then I'll, I'm getting close to doing telekinetic, and then once I've finished graveyard, I'm going to be doing telekinetic till I run out of an al run energy, and then doing alchemy. Okay, and as long as I have remembered how the graveyard room works, I'm fairly sure this will get me the final point I need. Yep, there we go, 390 graveyard points. That is the first room, well, I suppose the second room completed, uh, since I now have enough enchantment and graveyard. Alright, I just relogged so that I can show you guys this because, like, look, if you enter the alchemy room, you, you've entered the alchemist playground. If you enter the enchanter's room, 
it doesn't say anything. And if you enter the telekinetic, it says that you enter the telekinetic theater. If you go into the graveyard, it doesn't say anything. But then if you f turn your filter off, it does actually t show them all. It's just these two are, I don't get. I don't. What? What is this? Why do only two get filtered out? Oh. Hmm. Oh. Computer. 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 Yep. 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 This is going to be a nice sight to see. Look at this. 390 pizzazz points. I'm going to say yes, please, just so that he'll teleport me over to the exit. But I'm not going to be doing another one because that is all of the telekinetic points that I need. 440 pizzazz points. Master wand. There we go. Zero in each. I'm quite glad. <laughs> That's actually quite nice. Uh, yeah, but master wand. Nice. Uh, I was originally not going to bother wait what I had I've never seen that before why does it stick out your hand I don't know uh but yeah I I wasn't gonna bother try, trying to get this until I got a Kodai but I thought fuck it yes boys we finally got some more white lily seeds it has been I think I got these on like my second or something kill and I just haven't had any Quick explanation, my CC were doing a whole bingo thing, I don't really focus on it very much, but the reason for this clip is because one of them was to get a beginner clue unique, which is why I'm currently killing Halo Giants. Uh, I don't actually kill any more than this, I'm going to open the six caskets in a second, but let's just skip forward to that. Do this, and see what we get in these clues. Okay, <laughs> nice. Uh, there is the shoulder parrot, I think this goes in your ammo slot. Wait, oh, it's a cape slot, no! Oh, I'm sad. I ho I thought it was an ammo slot, but it's still pretty cool. This boy gonna be coming with me when I'm skilling. But yeah, let's see if there's anything else we get. Gonna drop those. Uh, yeah, no, that's getting dropped. Nope. Dropped. Drop. Well, keep those law runes. Everything else is getting dropped, though. Hey, we got the unique, and that's all that matters. This clip's four months old at this point, so I don't know why I was doing Tithe Farm, but I was, and here is 98 farming is a very cool level, I'm not gonna lie, I'm really looking forward to getting 99. It's a really cool cape, one of my favorites, and it's pretty damn useful. Boys, 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 we got the Tans Fang, I'm gonna just control print screen, take a picture of that for the bingo, but that is a Zora drop Sadly, I do already have a blowpipe. Well, I say sadly. Not really sadly at all, to be honest. I ha already have a blowpipe, so... Uh, uh, yeah, this, is this just going to be 20 scales for me? I'm going to dismantle it straight away, because I have no need for it. Ooh, heck, 666. But yeah, 20,666 now. Nice-oo. I'll be honest with you boys, didn't go to plan. <laughs> Dude, I hadn't done a solo raid in a while, so I thought let's give it a shot, and that was quite possibly the worst thing that I have ever done in my life. Boys, we got the Hydra's Fang. I'm gonna tell you out. Let's just grab the torso seeds and we may as well bury these. We found the threshold, boys. I start being shite at Hydra at 10 uh, minutes to 11 in the afternoon. I have done two trips and got three kills. It is not going well. I'm gonna leave it until tomorrow. I'm gonna find something else to do. Now, this is gonna. Oh, oh boys. 40 Onyx Bolt tips. I thought that was gonna be my MVP. Never mind. Well, I, 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 this, this Winter Todd is going on for so long, I've got 1200 points and I just got the level before finishing the game. 
Yeah, it is one in the morning, so I'm gonna go to bed. So I'm gonna wow you all real quick with the biggest Winter Todd crate unboxing that you have ever seen. Are you ready for this? Cool. Hey, I got three Ranars though. Alright, within the next couple uh, logs, I should be getting 82 fire making. Yep, there we go. There we go, 90 Herblore. I can now make super combat potions. Uh, I kind of want to finish all of these just so that I don't have the un unfinished pots, but I'm not going to do that right now, I don't think, because I kind of want to make myself some uh, some super combats. Alright, it skipped the message because I took damage, but I just hit 85 fire making. I also hit 88 woodcutting, uh, I think last game or the game before. And this was going to be 85 smithing. I can now make runite bars, which is pretty nice. It also means I'm going to have to get my uh, coal bag back out, because I may as well do that while I'm here. I think 88 smithing, that is enough for the this four. I'm so close to being able to make the shield as well, dude. But how, oh well. All this stuff's going to go back in the bank. Let's head to Sherlock, see what the next step is. Nice, a phalo step. I'm fairly sure I can do pretty much all of these, and I can make use of both my magic cape, and I'm just going to grab these, and my phalo tab. So let's grab all of these. As long as it's one of these items, I can do it. So let's see. What what you're going to want, phalo? Token used to kill mythical beasts, that be that, yeah? Nice. I like fellow steps. More fellow steps. Oh dear boys, we have Sherlock again. Kill the spiritual, magic, and godly while representing their own god, so cool. Oh dear, back to back Sherlock, what's it gonna be? Easy, nice. I think I'm gonna open these. Uh, so let's see. The easies first, these are probably aren't going to be very impressive. That changes the yawn emote, doesn't it? Hang on. Also, uh, two uniques, funky. Where's the yawn? Yeah. That definitely changed the yawn, emo yawn emote. Nothing special. Ooh, a Zami cloak. I'm not going to complain about that. Ooh, another cloak and a pink elegant skirt. Let's. It's. I guess we're playing dress up now, boys. Hang on. Let's go ancient cloak. I don't know anything for the torso yet. And there is our first master. Let's go smash this out. Hey, would you have a look at that? We actually got the black dragon mask. Sherlock, why do you do this to me? Two back-to-back -back Sherlock's in two. Master clues. What is it going to be? Blood rune. Oh. <laughs> well, I got the rune crafting boost. All right, let's put these down here. Three mediums. Pink power. Cool. Runes. Seventy three. Lol. Uh, yeah. Cool. Let's just clean this inventory up, and then I'll move on to the hearts, which is the actually interesting stuff. Okie dokie. Hard caskets. Ancient page. Nice. Uh, nothing special. Sourdough in page? It could be the last Sourdough in page. Uh, I actually wouldn't mind get, finishing off the Sourdough in book. It would clear up a bank space. Speaking of clearing up, let's do some Alkin. Alright, next hard caskets. I'm still looking for a heraldic helm and heraldic shield. Ooh, well, it's a shield at least. Uh, some nice black dehyde, some more black dehyde, and a bandos kite shield. Uh, last one, what are we gonna get? Sadly, we did not get the uh, heraldic shield, which is a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping we did, because I really do want to start saving these up, but it's really hard to save them up when I still need stuff from them. Alright, elite caskets. These typically aren't very good, but hey, I might get something good. Uh, 100k, 60k, 145k. Ooh, the sagacious spectacles. What are these? Do these make me look 
old? I don't know, do they? Let's see. Sagacious spectacles. Oh heck, I like them. Nice. Uh, that'll probably just be getting put in the uh, house though, to be honest. And final four elite caskets. Ooh, holy wraps. Uh, I have no idea how rare these are, but they look really cool and I like them, so... Yeah, pretty cool. I mean, I don't think I could have... Like, there's anything actually worth that they take the place of, so... Uh, yeah, pretty cool. Holy wraps, nice. And a master on the last one, so I guess I'm gonna go complete this, turn in some, uh, turn in some clues for another master, and then how many is that gonna be? Is that gonna be six master caskets? I think it might be. Oh no, feels bad, man. I don't have a dragon pickaxe. Oh, okay. Oh damn it. Okay, I'm going to have to learn how friggin' whatever it's called, that game mode in Mauritania, where you get the Amulet of the Damned, I've come, uh, sorry, I'm drawing a blank, I'm going to have to learn how that works, but not right now, because it is midnight and I am shattered, and I kind of want to, I don't know how long that's going to take, and I'm in the mood to open these, so we're just doing a box of four, uh, I'll, I'll open the other one when I get it, but yeah, let's see what we're going to get. Pet? That's not a pet. A good amount of runes, though. That is a crazy amount of stuff. Zami wines? Jeez. Onyx? Oh, it's worth a lot as well. What was in this one? Hey, also a pretty good one. Hey, you know what? I'll take that. All of those were pretty good. Also, another Guthix page. Is this going to be the Guthix page to actually finish off the set? Which one is it? Two. It's not. God damn it. <laughs> Blimey, soloing Shades of Morton is a slow process. Hey, from the 10 that I had in my bank, I got 9 keys. I don't actually know if there's a difference between all the different colors or not, so I'm going to assume there isn't. Also, I also don't know where I'm meant to go. Is it there? I think it's this. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's find the silver chest. Oh, I got a flame tear bag. I don't think... This is very useful for me. That's a brown. Is this red or crimson? This is red. Cool. Let's... Amulet of the Damned. I don't know if... I... An adamant Spear. I don't think I've ever seen one of them before. Fine Cloth. Amulet of the Damned. There we go, boys. Nice. And a Poisoned Addy Spear. Even odd odder. Right, I'm not going to use this black key. Alright, and that was the last step in the master clue, so what are we going to get in this master? Something good, please? Oof. It's not amazing. That's going to get dropped. I don't think these are worth anything. Yeah, no. Um, an armadillo page, though. That's cool. Uh, I didn't... Oh, I did bring a teleport. I was worried for a second there. 42 seconds. Nice. Uh, let's see what we're going to get for getting a new PB. A single Atta Seed. Two Ranar Seeds. Two Ranar Seeds. I am 100% down with that, dude. Nice. Hey, boys. The first sub two minute kill. Boys, we got it. We got it. Get the fuck out of here, cake. <laughs> uh, we got the Hydra's Heart. Oh, my days. I thought I hadn't picked it up for a second there. Right. Uh, I want to. I want to. I want to teleport out. Uh, I feel like I should teleport out. Really. I, I can make the ring now. Um, well, I was going for other kills, but as you can, like, dude, right, okay, as you can see, I just had a Hydra kill, where I had three special attacks in the, in the red phase. I, 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 <laughs> what, what, how, how, how did I deal so little damage to it? Like, you can even see that my potion only ran out in the second one, and then I actually drank another one. Would you, are you sure you want to combine the Hydra Heart, Hydra Eye, and Hydra Fang into the Brimstone Ring? This cannot be reversed. Yeah, no, why would I not proceed with the combination? Oh, boys. Oh, that's cool. That's, I think that's the same effect as, like, imbuing boots and things. Okay, uh, I've still got 20 kills left in my task. I'm probably going to go finish this off now, but I just want to take a look at the stats on this ring, because... It's finally 
a ring that I can use for range and magic. Alright, and this is the last kill of the task, and it's also going to be the last clip of the video because I feel like I've got up to a nice 20 minute mark and uh, people are going to be okay with that. I know it's been a long time since the last video, but that is just because general uh, just kind of didn't want to. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to speak to you guys in the next video, which hopefully won't be as long as this one, but I'm not going to make any promises at this point, because uh, fuck knows.